Alright, hello everyone and welcome back to Fallout Frost, where today we are still here in downtown, and I have a slight change of plans from what I was originally intending. Now, when I first started up the game today, I was thinking that we'd actually head back out to the surface, explore more around our general vicinity, and most importantly, check out the Old North Church. I'm intrigued to see who might be residing in it at this point in history, considering we're a long, long way away from having the railroad take up residency there. Now, I'm guessing probably a lot of ghouls, but who knows, it could be anything or anyone, and I'm kind of tempted to go check it out still, even now that I have decided to change plans. Now, the reason I want to change plans is because... I still don't know where a lot of these tunnels and subway lines lead to from here in downtown, and I kind of want to know where in the world all these places go, so that if we are out there in the outside world, we can easily make our way back here from other stations, etc. So I want to check out this door over here, the door that was under the wall bit over there, and then also travel back out to the main entrance bit and go through the other subway line that we hadn't originally come through. Uh, just to see where all those do take us and hopefully <laughs> have a interesting time along the way. So let's go check out this door first. I kind of think I know where this one is going, but I'm not entirely sure. My vote is that area where the ghouls are at the start of the game. And it's not. Ooh, no, this is a different area. I don't know where this is. Um, hmm. Oh, hello. Federation soldier. With a giant flamethrower. Really just you, one person, protecting this whole thing? Huh, interesting. Let's go check out and see what... Oh, well that might be why it's only one person protecting it. There's a giant hole. Huh. I kind of... I kind of want to know if I can go through that. <laughs> um, can I make this jump? Oh, I don't know. Either way, I'll go down there, and that is a secondary path. Let's actually quick save and uh, give this a shot. See if we can... Oh, God, I didn't actually get a sprint on that. And jump. Oh, God, we kind of made it. Oh, no, I'm stuck. I am not in a good position. Oh, boy. Okay, yeah, I'm trying to run and nothing. Oh, oh, if I try to crouch, we got up a little ways. Nope, that didn't work at all. Okay, okay. We're stuck. We we, we, are, we are officially stuck. Uh, oh, oh, I made up a little bit. Oh, come on, come on. I just want to know what's over here. Besides weird glowing bits of rock into the... Oh, God, I fell. Okay, well, I don't know if we can actually make that jump. <laughs> I mean, probably someone who is better at platforming could, but me, I uh, probably not. So I guess we're checking out this way then, which seems terrifying that we'd actually be dropping down this. But uh, let's see where in the world it takes us. Oh, we can actually kind of slide down. I am not touching the keyboard right now. We are just slide. Oh, no. Okay, we stop there. Perfect, perfect. So good. It's not just a death drop into the void. Okay, okay. Wait, hold on a moment. This looks very familiar. Huh, what's down this tunnel? Yeah, why does this look so familiar to me? Um... Oh my god, I think I know where we are. I think I know where we are. Hold on, up here? And Q! Yes! <laughs> uh, it's the Federation outpost we stole the key from! Oh my god, I thought this looked familiar. I checked out that way back there one of the times we were here and saw that it was just a vertical drop down from someplace. So cool. Hi guys, how are all of you doing? S yeah. Sorry sorry about taking your key. Um, huh. Well, crap. I think we're going to load that save file from the top because I don't want to make my way all the way back up from here. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that'd be a good thing at all. So, let, yeah, let's just go and do that. Let's hit load and subway line. Perfect. And that should bring us back to the top. We're going to try the jump once more. But I don't know if that jump is possible. It might be from the other side, but from this angle, I don't, I don't know. All right, let's try it again. 
Oh, I did even worse that time. Oh, God. Can we actually make it back up this cliff face here? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I don't think we can. Well, this was a futile effort on my part. Fair enough. Okay, we're going to have to hit... We're gonna have to hit load again. All right, and I can hear certain people in the comments, you know, very, very much squirming at that who don't like me reloading. But you know what? Fun times. Oh God, I really want to make it over there, but I don't think I can make this jump. I mean, maybe, but ah, it'd probably take me 10 or 12 tries to do it successfully. And that I think is a bit much for today. So let's go back into downtown and yes. then check the other area that I was intrigued by. At least that I think I'm intrigued by. I'm not 100% certain that I've gone through that door, but I kind of feel like maybe we did and I'm just forgetting now. But yeah, we're gonna check. The next one is the one under the wall here. So down a yaw. So let's see where this door goes to. All right, so we unlocked it with our key. God, I love that key. Really, really do love that key. Oh, this goes to here. Okay, so this is the one that goes back to the... Wait, is this? Yes, this is the start area of the game with the ghouls and the chamber over there of death. Fair enough, so we now know where that door is. Excellent. Have we gone through this door? I just don't remember it. Huh. But all right, so we know where those two doors lead. One down to a horrible, horrible drop of death down to the little outpost, that one, to the ghouls, and so one, a final subway line to check, and I have a feeling this one will actually go someplace because it seems to be on the main line, and that's of course that direction. Now I do still want to know what in the world is down there, but I can't get through those locked doors or those turrets. So back into this main subway line. And we came from that direction, I believe. I think. Yes, yes, because we came down the tunnel and I hadn't I didn't see the lights for a little bit. So now we're gonna go through this entrance and see where this takes us. I wonder where we'll head. Ghouls and machine gun turrets. Hello, ghouls! kind of like the machine gun turret being my wingman here, though. Yeah, let's have him be our wingman. Hi, ghouls! Turret, kill them! Kill them, good. Come on, come over here! Oh, they're pathing. Their pathing is still horrible as always. Oh! Oh, God, it's shooting at me! Why is it shooting at me? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Why did it shoot at me? I'm... I don't know. Shouldn't it have been our friend? <laughs> um, interesting. That I was not expecting. Oh, we're here again. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That was indeed... Where'd the person go who was guarding here? Oh, no. Did she jump down the hole to try and save me? Oh, she's gone now. She's gone. <laughs> Seriously, where did this guard go? Man, this the, uh, I'm really loving this mod. It has a lot of really great stuff to it, but it, it does still have a crap load of bugs of people disappearing when they shouldn't, etc. But all right, so let's uh, come in through here then. Well, crap, I want to go back over there and see why that turret tried to kill me. Was it because I had a weapon? Does that turret just go after anyone with a weapon? Because that seems very awkward. All I wanted to do was kill ghouls. Hmm. I wonder if maybe I don't pull out a weapon, if it would still do so. Okay, it's gone now too. Okay, you all saw it. We came straight back here and the turret is gone now. Okay, well I was gonna try like running over there and like pulling the zombies, ghouls towards me and maybe if I didn't pull out a weapon it wouldn't shoot. But now it's just disappeared, so okay, let's just kill the zombies ourselves. Take this, ghoul! And, and this, yeah, he's really having a lot of trouble pathing. There we go, perfect. Also, the one here has money. Cow. Hi, feral ghoul. Please get stuck on fence. He did not get stuck on fence. Ooh, God, he got us good, though. 
And... Okay, he's dead. We are almost dead from radiation, though. Oh, my freaking crap. Um... Wow, we are covered in radiation. Oh, boy. That's not good. Crap, all I have is this bandage. Let's take that. It might save us. It's not going to save us. We're dead. Wow. Wow. That, um... I don't know if we should go that way again. I kind of want to, though. I want to see what's on the other side. I want to see what's on the other side. Ah, and we're here. With no guard once more. Oh, jeez. <laughs> you know, I probably should have actually made a safe uh, point right by the ghouls. But um, that thought didn't cross my mind for some strange reason. Huh. All right. Well, back over this direction. <laughs> Let's hope third time's a charm. and Maybe we get out the shotgun. Oh, uh, because what saved me with the first one, who was way higher level than me, was the fact that he was behind that fence and I could just kite him there. That other ghoul, though, he came right at me, which, uh... Damn, did he get me good. Jeez. And I didn't really have a lot of room to maneuver, either. Okay, what grenades do I have? I want to blow them up now. <laughs> okay, three frag mines, two frag grenades, and a stun grenade. We got a couple of rounds for the short pipe rifle. Ooh, shotgun to the face when he gets close? I'm thinking shotgun to the face when he gets close. Nice. Nice. Yeah, and that turret is gone now. That's very... Oh my god, now the ghouls are gone. What the hell? What is going on in this game? Um... Well, that's weird. And why is there a Nuka-Cola bottle inside of the cow? I'm taking it. <laughs> but I don't know why it's there. Oh, uh, Jesus. Yeah, where are the... Oh my god, yeah. There are some serious glitches in this mod. Hmm... All right, well, let's, uh, gate. More ghouls! How many? I'm just seeing the two. Oh, nope, three. Yeah, looks like I got three. I got some more maneuvering room, which is good. Hi, hey, ghouls! Ha-ha! Come up behind him! Get him in the head, damn it! Oh, he got me. He got me in the side. All right, we got one more coming for me. No, he actually doesn't seem to be too interested. Interesting. Or he is and just having trouble finding his way to me. See the only one left? He does appear to be. All right, anything in the cows? Nope. Hi, ghoul. Come at me, friend. There we go. Oh, no, he didn't die. Oh, boy. Oh, God, he's one of these that's all covered in ash. Okay, kite him, kite him, kite him good. He is not going down, and I feel ill. I'm infected. Oh, freaking sweet. There we go. Jesus. Ooh, baseball. I actually need a baseball for leather. Research test tube, shot glass. Oh, crap, we're infected now. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Periodic damage with that infection. I don't have near enough equipment to actually build the antibiotics that we need. Oh, boy. Toy rocket ship. No, I don't care about that. Hmm. Oh, hello. More ferals. Ooh, many more. F oh. I think I went chose the wrong way to go. I think I chose the wrong way to go, guys. Let's take a drink. <laughs> huh. Well, we need a bandage, certainly. Yeah, I I'm, I'm really have not found as many aid items as we had in previous games so far. Yeah, I'm going to have to bandage for now. Heal myself up. We might drink some whiskey for some strength. Hmm... Or go in with the gun and explosives. I mean, that's a thing. We have 24 shotgun rounds that I haven't used yet, which could be fun. I'm thinking that's fun. And grenade. And a grenade. Ha! Ooh, there was something that lit on fire in there. Cool. Okay, there's secondary explosions going on. And the ghouls are running away. 
Wow. I don't I don't know what I hit, but I hit something good. Jeez. Okay, so it looks like we've got just two ghouls left down there. Also, why did that zoom in so much? Oh, oh, you're not a survivor anymore, my dear. Oh boy, all right, and grenade. <laughs> Uh-oh, I don't think it made it to him. Oh, we got one of them. Oh no, we got both, perfect, perfect, and oh God, there goes that infection. Oh no, oh, oh, I have more bottles to fill. I'll take you. Also, have more bottles to fill. No, oh, I had that. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't need you. Oh, God. Radiation in the water. Well, I'm not at grenades, which is a thing. I'm kind of sad by that, but uh, we lived. Mole rat teeth, skull fragment. I'll take the flip lighter. You, survivor. Well, we're checking your journal here. Joanne's journal. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Airport station has really become a bustling place these last few weeks. With Revere Beach gone, all of the scavers have relocated here. Interesting. Probably not a friendly place for me, though. It's sad what happened up there, but I can't help but appreciate uh, the added business it gives us. Too true. Happy Halloween! Took the kids down uh, to downtown as a treat. The kind of people you meet there. Hi, met a nice scaver from all the way in the fens. His name is Matt, but that's not the that's not to say the airport station was bad either. It's gotten so crowded there, we've had to start setting up sleeping bags in the parking garages and concourse. Man, we need to really check out that area. Things are going well with Matt. The kids like him too. Oh, they all died. Yeah, they're all gonna die. Well, clearly she's dead. But he worries too much. He keeps going on about leaks in the walls, about how it's not safe to hang around in the concourse. If the air is so toxic, why isn't anybody getting sick? Yeah, I seem to remember her face being somewhat ghoul-esque-like. So, um, yeah. Oh, and look at next entry. I feel awful. <laughs> I think Matt was right. I look awful. My hair is almost all gone and my skin's scabbing up. Merry Christmas. Matt's gone back to downtown to talk with the captain about all of this. And final, is this the final entry? Yes, final entry. Things are getting worse. Miss Hines from across the tracks looks even more decrepit than usual, and I swear Mr. War growled at me. But Matt's coming back soon. I know it. He's coming back with medicine and help, and we'll all be well again in no time. Yeah, no. Nope. You all died. Okay, well, fair enough. Ooh, so I wonder if all these ghouls were f coming back from there. Interesting. All right, well, let's go this way. Check out what might be through this door. Try and stay out of the water. Boston Airport Ruins! <gasps> Get out the gun. <laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting to go there today, but fair enough. Oh, I guess that does make sense. We are very close to there with the downtown station. Hmm. All right. Oh, God. That's a machine gun turret. I'm going to put away my gun. Maybe it won't shoot at me. No, yeah, it's red. It's going to shoot at me. Shotgun is not going to do well against it. Short pipe rifle. That'll do the trick. Oh my god, die! Yeah, I, I shot it at least twice. A couple of those shots did fail, and that, um... Oh, yay, the infection. Yeah, that. Well, we're undetected still. Somehow. Even with all those gunshots. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Let's just stay away from that thing, and hopefully not die from our infection either. That'd be good. Um, anything in there? No... Paintbrush. Stealth boy? Cool. Crap load of light bulbs, empty paint can. God, I can't see a thing. Which means, of course, you guys can see even less on YouTube. 
which is always so damn impressive. You have guys, you guys have no idea how much I raise the brightness on these episodes so you guys can hopefully see something. But something about how the how YouTube compresses stuff, man. It just it makes things so much darker even with trying to make it brighter for you. All right, let's try and not get hit by the this thing. Oop, nope, can't go that way. Mm -hmm. Chemistry jar. Can I shut off this? Ooh, we could, potentially. Is this the first time we've hacked in this new game? No, it, it can't... Wait. No, it has, it has. The last time I remember hacking in Frost was back in Concord, and that was with our previous character. So yes, this is the first time we've done it with this character. Okay, 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 okay. Now I understand, and it makes less sense now. Or more sense, not less. Uh, wise. Ooh, zero likeness. Oh, jeez. Got it. Bam, there we go. Turret control. Oh my god, it's not even activated. <laughs> I was shooting at it for nothing. Oh god. Okay. Well, now we have it unlocked, so if we do get someone trying to kill us, we can run back here. Wow. Tried to shoot at it and absolutely nothing. Packets of cigarettes. I don't even want to know what's over there. Oh god. Oh, the infection. Ooh. Fusion cells. Five, five, six rounds. Pipe pistol. Turpentine. Lots of fuel on the floor that if it gets ignited will kill me immediately. Oh my god, a mining helmet. Oh my god, guys, we have a mining helmet. That means we have light. We have light. Oh, and it takes off our gas mask. Oh, but look. Light. Oh my god. Yes, we know where a mining helmet can be found. You just got to get through annoying ghouls that'll try and kill you. And oh my god, we have an infection that's going to kill us. Oh god, why? Why when I finally find a mining helmet? Do I have any form of healing right now? Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I really don't. Oh no. We may die from our uh, infection here today. And that is a very, very bad thing. Oh boy, all right, what else is around here? There's a feral ghoul. Oh look, another one. He's searching, probably doesn't help that I have a giant light on him now. <laughs> oh man. I'm actually a little bit paranoid now that I know that I have, I finally found a helmet. I finally found one. And then all of this had to happen. Why? Oh, God. Ooh, we could go up the elevator instead of dealing with these people. And fire! <laughs> oh, God, it didn't light him on fire! Ah, crap. And... Doop, boop, boop. Perfect. Just what I wanted to see. Well, bottle cap. Okay. Oh, God, the infection spread. Oh, look, Feral Ghoul in there. Let's ignore him. If we can make it to the end of the 30-minute episode without dying, I may cheat in some antibiotics. Oh, God, it didn't work. Okay, that did. I'm probably dead now. <laughs> oh, God, 17 rounds. Yep, there I died. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. Oh, God. This is an episode of Deaths right here. Okay. But, but, guys, hear me out here. We know where that helmet is now. Oh, Jesus. I forgot this was my last save file. Okay. Okay. Um. Huh. 
Now the question is, with the 25 minute mark, do I try and blitz my way back to getting that helmet? Or do... I kiss it goodbye for now and start going another direction. I really want that helmet. <laughs> and I want to see what the airport's like. So that, that is kind of a... Definitely a thing there that I want to do. Let's get out the ripper. Oh boy. <laughs> back to the back to the subway line. Oh god. Oh hey, and yeah, they're not here again. Ooh, and different loot this time. Alright, what do the cows have? Nothing, nothing. Uh beaker. Oh god, jump over. And Oh my god, they're not here either. Okay, yeah, this is very strange that this mod does this sometimes. Because I think this might be potentially the reason why we never found people in that one station which everyone else, in my last playthrough, uh, as the station that we made our way... Skull A Station, there's the name. That we made it into got a lot of great equipment from. Everyone in the comments was going on about, well, there were crap loads of people there for me. And of course, we actually found people when we briefly went to look at it on this playthrough. But now they all seem to have disappeared. Oh, that's what exploded. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Okay, well, I picked up the journal. Winter jacket and jeans. Oh, man, I got so much experience from all these things. We got a level. We had a level. Ah, I'm actually kind of annoyed by that now. I mean, we'll live to get the mining helmet, which is awesome. But, we don't get the level. Ah, oh, I really wanted that level. Oh, well, let's go find the mining helmet again. That is so strange. Yeah, it seems like if you die to things in an area, and if you reload back in, they're not always there. Okay, I'm still paranoid about that thing, so I'm going undetected. Okay, you know what? Let's go grab the mining helmet first. And uh, make sure to hack this again, just to make sure that we have access to it. Oh my god, Nuka-Cola. I didn't loot you last time. Perfect. Alright. Yes, 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 yes. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. What do we got here? Let's try Eric. One! Ooh. Ooh. New. Nope. All right, back out and back in. All right, what do you got on this one? Prod word ruin sure loud code love pots sold boys mind. No. No, I'm not doing very well on this one. Ah. Okay. Ward? Hmm, that one started quite well with two. Hmm. I'm in. There we go. Alright. Well, actually, double check the turret control that it is deactivated. Yep, currently deactivated. Okay, now let's get our helmet. Oh my god, we finally get one. We finally get one, and we're not infected right now. Oh, it's pink this time. <laughs> I don't care. We have the mining helmet. You guys will actually be able to see what I'm doing in these episodes. Oh, it makes me happy. Oh, it makes me so happy. And let's slowly back away from all of this other stuff. Okay. Oh, the fusion cells aren't here this time. Unless the... Oh, there's flamer fuel. A bucket. You know, I was thinking maybe we could put the bucket on that one guy's head and steal all of his crap. Let's take that just in case for the future. Oh god, this is a 10 millimeter pistol now. Oh wow, alright, cool. Uh, nothing else of use in here though, but let's turn on the light. Ha ha ha, yes. Alright, let's avoid that area for now. And go and actually have a proper look through here. Before ending the episode. Of course, we are at the half-hour mark, basically, already. Yeah, none of you are useful. 
That really is a lot of light bulbs. <laughs> um, let's see, let's see. Take you guys for water. Alarm clock, wrench. Yeah, really not a whole lot in this place. But yeah, okay, that's gonna be it then, guys, for today. We have the mining helmet, and we died like five times. So overall, I'd say more of a success than a failure, but hey, that's, um, that's just me. But that's gonna be it for today, folks. I hope you all have enjoyed, and of course, that you do come back for the next when we're actually gonna go and check out the airport, I guess. I think that would be a good plan. But until that time, thank you for watching, and as always, have a good one.